With an updated look at your forecast, I'm storm tracker Dan Martinez. This week, we're going to be primarily focusing on, on the heat. We're in the moderate to high category here for the heat. Wind, it'll be in the moderate category as we track windy conditions through the next few days. Low end of, for dust and for rain as well. Let's talk about what we're expecting on our future track computer model. Rolling through your, mem through your Memorial Day Monday, you see things clear for El Paso and Las Cruces. Some activity possible over to the north around the TRC area. Even Redoso could squeeze out a shower or two. As we roll through, even into your Tuesday, your commute tomorrow morning looking just fine. No problems to talk about. And then we'll start to track some clouds to come in on Tuesday that will just stick around for, for a few hours or so. Here's a look at our accumulation model. Everything kind of staying over to the east of us on Thursday. That's the, the next time we're going to be tracking the potential for some rain. But in the meantime, El Paso's weekend forecast 91 on Saturday, 90 on Sunday, Las Cruces 89 Saturday, and 90 on your Sunday. Your next seven days for wind, 25 mile per hour winds expected for the day today. So we'll be in the breezy category, but we'll jump up to windy on Wednesday, Thursday, and back up into windy for your Saturday into your Sunday as well. El Paso, 68 degrees for Ridoso, uh, I should say, and then 82 degrees for Alamo Gordo, 82 for Deming, 81 for TRC. Tonight we'll drop things into the 50s for Alamo Gordo and 53 for TRC. Here's a look at the seven-day forecast for you now. Breezy conditions expected for your Monday, 84 degrees, and then 89 for your Tuesday. We'll be in the windy category, as I mentioned, on Wednesday into Thursday. That 10% chance of rain showing up on the board there. But notice this temperature here, 95 degrees. Pretty darn warm, if you ask me. And then notice here for Friday, 92 degrees with those breezy conditions. 91 expected for your Saturday into your Sunday. We'll also be in the windy category then as well. But those overnight conditions will stay into the 60s for the next seven days.